Hi, good morning. And um, welcome back to the Angler's Diary. Another page in the Angler's Diary. Um, and welcome back to the far northeast of England. <laughs> so here's a question for all you tench fishers out there. How early is too early to get a early spring tench? We're going to try and find out today. something on the end but it's not the tench we're after <laughs> good size brain though <laughs> That's a bream blank saver for both Dave and I. His was a right old warrier though, covered in spawning tubercles already, so I'm not sure what that, uh, that tells us. But uh, yeah, a right old battler that one. Another good bream for David. Um, he's fishing a flatbed feeder right out in uh, in the open water, which is pretty deep here. Um, and that just occurs to me that I haven't told you where we are. <laughs> uh, this is one of my local club waters. It's called Horton Grange, um, and it's where I had some really good tench days last um, last summer, last spring. Um, and then at the moment we're struggling on, on the tench front, but uh, the bream seem prepared to uh, to cooperate. <laughs> Carp. Carp. Oh, no, a tench. <laughs> Meal. <laughs> well done. Well, that's what we came for. something happening. <laughs> Can we know what size would you see that is? Oh you got one? Got something. <laughs> got something. Another bream. Another <laughs> bream is it? <laughs> At least it's a fish. It might not be what we came for. It's 
taken David to do that. <laughs> Something having a look. I'm just wondering, you know, time of day. We've got a sun. Half of it, still in a bit warmer, you know. Yeah. Not sure whether it's still there or. One thing I can be certain of, it wasn't a tench bite. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's another bream. Actually, it's an eye, I think. Is it? it is, huh? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, it's, uh, it's an eye. I'll get a look at this one. Yeah. I haven't caught many of these really strong fish mind. But there you go. That, as far as I know, is an eye. <laughs> well, we've got a couple of hours left to come out of the net. And uh, there's been a bit of a change in the weather. It's bright and sunny now. Although, um, some fairly ominous looking clouds over here. <laughs> um, and it's gone a bit quiet. Neither David or I have had any, uh, any activity for over an hour now. So, uh, whether the, the change in the weather has put them off or what, I don't know. But as I say, we've got a couple of hours here. At last! Green for David. <laughs> yeah, yeah. He's cracked it. He's found the magic bait for green. <laughs> well, it's been a while. <laughs> it's not a tench. It's another eye. Everything, everything but a tench, David. That's basically it. about an hour to go or so to get the elusive tench. <laughs> How the hell I missed that I've got no idea. What? It took off like nobody's business. inept <laughs> I suspect it's another bream and no it's another eyed <laughs> For today, I'd only caught 
one-eyed in my life. And now I've had four. <laughs> Shouldn't really complain, but you know what I'm going to say next? It's not a tench. <laughs> Well, that's it. Everything but a tench. And I suspect that could be the title for the video. <laughs> David, um, to, uh, to answer the question that I posed at the start is when's early, too early? Well, it depends whether you're a David or not. Because obviously he managed a tench and I didn't. Still, there'll be another time. Um, thanks for watching. If you've enjoyed this one I'm pleased if you've stuck with it this far thank you very much and I'll see you again soon bye for now